if a child has autism, I think they have the likelihood of benefiting from FMT. FMT. That's short for fecal microbiota transplant. It's made from bacteria and other microbes taken from the feces of a healthy person. Patients take it orally or by enema. It's shown promise for treating a range of gastrointestinal issues, but naturopath Jason Klopp claims it can also treat autism. I just want to see dramatic improvements in digestion, language, behavior, sleep, cognitive ability, social awareness, um, social interaction. So we see all of those things. FMT isn't approved for use on autism in Canada or the U.S., so Klopp offers retreats at a clinic in Mexico. The cost? $15,000 U.S. I think currently the risks are way too high to be doing this as a medical treatment. Scientists tell CBC they're alarmed. The science isn't solid. One study suggests fecal transplants could help with autism, but it was very small, had no control group, and didn't account for the placebo effect. And the study authors recommend against going to see CLOP for treatment, saying the research isn't conclusive. Doctors say patients could be at risk for serious infection. Charging $15,000 to people without having really confirmed data is, it, it's really borders on ethical, being very unethical. Health Canada says it's looking into Klopp's business. It's also caught the attention of officials in BC, including the College of Naturopathic Physicians, and even the province's top doctor, who says she has a warning for parents. This is an experimental unproven treatment that has dangers, so I would not recommend that anybody use this type of treatment. Klopp declined an interview with CBC. Bethany Lindsay, CBC News, Vancouver.